This is Brian McCullough from BMC, and today we are here at MG 2011 in Reno with Dar Plano, correct, who owns a 1958 MGA 1500. Yes. Can you tell me a little about the car? It's a car I've had for uh, 47 years. Uh, I was a daily driver for probably uh, 17, 18 years and uh, built a new house and put it in storage and did all of this and uh, was driving other cars uh, and kept it in storage, I guess, until I retired in uh, 2000. And, uh, storage and start the restoration and it was a two-year restoration complete every nut and bolt came off of it everything came apart and then it was reassembled in about two years uh, repainted and everything was like the three R's we replaced or we repainted or we replated and uh, then it's been finished uh, since the, the beginning of uh, 2003 and been driving it to events since then okay now when uh, when we discussed the components replaced on it, uh, as, in, as in removed and changed out to something else, you had mentioned the five speed. The five speed it was originally done with the four speed, and we left the four speed in it until two years ago. Uh, two years ago, uh, I decided to change over to the Sierra, Ford Sierra five speed, and so the five speed is now in it, and it's been in it now for uh, a couple of years. And then I also added a trailer to uh, make it a little easier to carry the spare parts. And when my wife travels with me, suitcases and clothes, because obviously you can't put anything uh, much in traveling in the trunk with me, you're going to carry a lot of spare parts. So we now have the trailer in this, and it makes it nice to travel in. Yeah, I was very impressed looking at your trailer, finding the, uh, the Dayton wire wheels, bolt-on wire wheels. But poker tires, you said. Poker tires, Dayton wire wheels on the trailer uh, to match the wire wheels that are on the uh, on the MG. Okay, and then the taillight plinths. I, I thought that was very unique as well. You turned the those upside down? Yeah, the taillights, uh, when, when the trailer was manufactured, they were nice enough to leave everything off the back of it and so that I could mount MGA taillights on the back of them, it turned them upside down and then turned the inside lights back around and get, in order to get the lenses to be correct, but the angle was just right and so it turns out nice with the uh, mm -hmm. MG tail lights and the MG emblems on the back of the uh, uh, back of the trailer. Okay, that's fantastic. Now, going back to the car, all four, four wheel drum brake, all four wheel, wheel drum brake, still a 1500 engine, it's the original block and the original head, uh, all, everything is original. And you said even an original rear end gear ratio, hasn't been re-geared? Nope. It's okay. not been re-geared, re -ge re it's the same rear end uh, ratio as it had before. And the gearbox, the first, second, third, and fourth are identically the same as the uh, original gearbox. The fifth is the overdrive. Okay, I hear a lot of questions from people asking, what have you done to your electrical system? So tell me about that. Uh, all of the wiring was replaced, but it's the standard uh, harness that went in. Uh, all the lights, the bulbs are all the same. Uh, either, you know, th those were replaced, of course, but they're just the standard bulbs that came with it. Positive ground still? No, I converted it over to negative ground. Uh, all the gauges came out and went back to be uh, redone. Uh, then when I went to the five-speed, I had a spare uh, odometer speedometer, and I sent it in and had it recalibrated so that now the, the speedometer and the odometer are correct for the overdrive transmission. Okay. Well, it's a lovely car, and I, I really want to thank you for showing it to us. Uh, I appreciate it. Yeah. And, uh, and this you. is this is actually the second meet that I know we've been together at. Yes, GT35, right, Wisconsin last right. last year, 2010. Yes. yes. Uh, and that was a fun meet. Unfortunately, I can only stay for a couple days, but everybody tells me that uh, I missed out on all the fun at, at the last few days. It was a it was a fun meet, and the weather held out. It was nice. It was a good meet. Yeah. yeah. So. Well, thank you, Dart. Appreciate it. Thanks, we'll Brian. Uh huh. Thanks very much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Bye bye.